Hello and welcome back to another housing video here with Mimioni for Final Fantasy XIV and this time around we're looking at uh, yet again another patch 5.3 iteration, this time the Bluebird Mobile. I know for a fact that this was one of the furnishing contest design entries and it's so great that we got this one in the game, I'm going to show you in just a second. So let me first show you how you make this, this is actually a level 80 basic woodworking recipe and uses four lignum vitae lumber two Santee Clumber and two Titan Bronze Nuggets, so not actually that difficult to make. And uh, it's got a recommended craftsmanship of 1866, but you can do it lower than that if you desire. It says, Bluebird Mobile. If one bluebird brings happiness, surely those who adorn their homes with this revolving display have naught to fear. Aside from taking a faux bluebird to the eye, should they move carelessly? And uh, it's 430 there, desynthesizable by Carpenter. Uh, this is currently, you know, obviously market tradable. You can make a decent amount of gill with it if this is something you want to consider crafting and selling. And it looks absolutely durable. So let's have a look at that. We're recording this live today. I got accused of over editing stuff that didn't need it. So we're going to just, you know, show this off. So this is the actual Bluebird mobile, one that we made earlier. And as you can see already, it has a beautiful revolving motion. Um, I was thinking of placing it above the door um, where it will allow us to place that. But I think once we do a preview, let's just whack it over here so we can get a better close up and then we'll put it somewhere sensible. So as you can see, uh, if we go into first person mode, it is a completely delightful model, isn't it? With those bluebirds swinging around there, having a the time of their lives. Um, I don't believe this has any interactions or anything like that. No, it doesn't appear to. And I'm not sure if this is diable. Let's check that out. Um, it certainly doesn't look like it. No, I don't believe it is. But that's fine. It's a, you know, a brass sort of mounted Bluebird mobile. What's not to love? This is the sort of thing you would love to put up above um, sort of like a kid's crash or something like that. Of course, we don't have uh, the, the availability to have our own children in the game, unfortunately, or fortunately, as some people might say. Um, but, you know, it is very adorable, isn't it? This is the sort of thing that would look great in a, sort of like a, if you were to make a, a sort of like a faux garden in your basement. I've seen a lot of people have do that and make little fountains out of shower heads and verdant partitions. So that's the sort of thing that I would probably love to see with this. So let's quickly move this then. And we'll put this where I wanted to place it. Um, because I think it'd be nice. Because we don't have anything above our door. Um, of course, it has the usual placement restrictions, which is unfortunate. And we dropped it. <laughs> uh, <I did. laughs> oh, there we go. Okay, well, let's just place it there and then we can move it up. Doing it live is a lot a lot more difficult um, than actually just editing it post, as you can probably admire. Uh, that looks a bit centralized. We'll go with that. But yeah, the idea is that, you know, everybody walks in and they have a, a fine time and they go, oh, look, a bluebird. And if an Allison walks in, they bash their head on it and go, ow. And that's my... You know, that would be um, my work accomplished, really, wouldn't it? Um, if we could get at least one Ellison with a, a bump on their head, then I know I've, I've completed my goal. No, it's absolutely adorable. I, uh, I, I thank Square Enix, honestly, for choosing this one to incorporate. It's such a simple design, but adds um, quite a lot to the game. I've just realized that the bluebirds there kind of clip through the door. Mm, maybe I can't put this here after all. <laughs> but it's just this one bluebird. He, he's a bit further out than the rest. Everyone else seems to be spinning fine, and then he's just like, Roar, I'm going through the door. See me on the other side. I don't know. We've got Schrodinger's uh, bluebird there. Is it the same bluebird when it's inside there? Is it dead? Is it alive? Is it still, you know, an inanimate object? We'll never know because it's going through a dimensional portal. Or at least 90% of its body is. Anyway, that's pretty much my video on the Bluebird mobile today. You can pick this up on the market board from other players, of course. It's not too expensive considering uh, how easy it is to craft and all of those materials are pretty easy to get. Um, so I wouldn't spend more than, I don't know, 200K on this at any one point. But there we go. Hopefully that uh, fulfilled your desire of seeing what this item looked like and we'll move on to many others in upcoming videos. So thank you kindly for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. Let me know if you've picked this one up for your housing spaces yet and where you plan to use it. And I'll see you all next time.